This is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at calculating relative atomic mass. We'll start the video by looking at the mass spectrum of lead. A mass spectrum shows mass to charge ratio on the x axis and relative abundance on the y axis. So, this mass spectrum shows there are four naturally occurring isotopes of lead, which are lead 204, lead 206, lead 207, and lead 208. And the relative abundances are 2%, 24%, 22%, and 52% respectively. On the right, we can see this data summarized in table form, where we have the four isotopes together with their relative abundances. So next, we'll use this data to calculate the relative atomic mass of lead. So to calculate the relative atomic mass, we multiply the mass number of each isotope by its relative abundance. We then add each of these together and divide by 100. So for lead, that's 204 times 2, plus 206 times 24, plus 207 times 22, plus 208 times 52, which we then divide by 100. And this gives us a relative atomic mass of lead of 207.20. Note that relative atomic mass is dimensionless, which means it does not have a unit. In our next example, we'll calculate the relative atomic mass of iron. So in this table, we have the relative abundances of the three naturally occurring isotopes of iron, which are iron 54, iron 56, and iron 57. And the relative abundances of these isotopes are 5.95%, 91.88%, and 2.17% respectively. So once again, to calculate the relative atomic mass, we multiply the mass number of each isotope by its relative abundance. We then add these together and divide by 100. So that's 54 times 5.95, plus 56 times 91.88, plus 57 times 2.17, which we then divide by 100. And this gives us a relative atomic mass of iron of 55.90. We'll end the video by looking at how to calculate the relative abundance of isotopes. So in this question we're told that bromine with a relative atomic mass of 79.90 has two isotopes, bromine 79 and bromine 81. And we'll calculate the relative abundance of each isotope. To do this we set up the equation as shown and solve for x. And this gives a value of x of 45. So the isotope bromine 81 has a relative abundance of 45%. And the isotope bromine 79 has a relative abundance of 